Alrighty. <clears throat> Howdy, neighbors, and welcome back to One Night Hot Springs. Last time, we got two out of the seven endings. Found out a little secret about our girly pop here, Haru. And we're just vibing and hanging out. Oh, so this is Monami, and it's her birthday. That's why we're here. And let's continue. Let's keep Monami company. Let's hang up for a little bit longer. Yay! Let's head over to the window. Also, I don't know if I mentioned this, but the art style is so stinking cute. I love it. The moon is really beautiful tonight. It really is. I love how quiet it is out here. It's like the whole world is asleep. Yeah. It's too bad you didn't get to enter the big baths. It's okay. I'm happy I got to. Stay in this beautiful royal con. Oof. Well, I never go to a place like this. Still, it's fine, Monami. Thank you for inviting me. It's been a good trip. It isn't over yet. It's kind of, kind of strange to think that I'm officially an adult now. Alright, the clock turns 12. Monami's birthday will be over. Better present, bud. If it's okay to give it to her, obviously I'm gonna give her the fucking gift. Oh, are you okay? I actually got your present. Oh, really? Thank you. I don't have it on me right now. I give it to you in the morning. Of course. And tomorrow. I think I'm gonna head to bed. Okay, Haru. Oh, hey, Haru. You can not tell me anything, right? Anything. What's up with you? Nothing, but I just... You don't have to worry about me. Good night. Good night. Wish you were more honest with me, Haru. It's morning. Are you awake? Good morning. What time is it? A little late. I should check out soon. Oh. I'm gonna give one of you the present. I'll give it to her. She'll think it's weird. Haru? Could you close your eyes for a moment? Okay. Okay, just stay still for a moment. Sure, but why? Just wait. Okay. Okay, you can open your eyes. Happy birthday. Put my present for you in your bag. But don't open it until you get home, okay? Why? Please just don't. Okay. Or is there anything you want to tell me? If you do, why don't you tell me, no matter what it is? Did you hear me talking yesterday? I did. But you never tell me anything, Haru. When I'm worried, if I ask you, just tell me you're fine. Even when you're obviously not fine. <clears throat> but I don't want to pry. If I had known that you were having a tough time at school, I would have. Oh, I'm on me. I just didn't want to trouble you. Trouble me? My best friend. You could never be trouble to me. You mean the world to me. So sorry I couldn't do anything to help. No, it's not your fault. I never told you anything. It's just. I don't want you to treat me differently. I don't treat me differently because. I'm trans. But not you, Monami. You've always treated me the same. As your friend. I was so scared of doing anything that might change that. Oh, I'm so sorry, Monami. No, I'm sorry. I felt you couldn't tell me. Nothing you say could ever change how I feel about you. You will always be my oldest and dearest friend. Monami. I want you to be honest with me. Did I make you uncomfortable by asking you to come on this trip? Have you asked? I do feel a little unsure about what to do, but I'm really happy you invited me to this girl's only trip. Who was I invited to? Thanks, Monami. 
Promise me you won't keep any more secrets. I promise. Is there anything else they want to tell me before we go? Not right now. I told you everything I want to tell you right now. But if you have any questions, the promise I'll answer them honestly too. Thanks, Haru. You're not going to be an for the present. Now, thank you for listening and accepting the present. Haru. Morning. Do her up early. Not really at all, but we have to check out soon. You'll be getting ready to go then. As you should, we get changed. We have to check out in time. Somehow. I'm hungry though. Why don't we have any breakfast? I'm gonna go see what there is to eat in town. I really had a chance to look around. It was so fun. I think I'll head back first. Do you have something to do today? It's a bit tired, that's all. That's too bad. Wanna head out there, Monami? I'll be... I'll be, I'll be okay on your own, Haru. I'll be fine. I promise. Okay, then. Let's go, Erika. See you later, Haru. See you, Suzuki. Bye. This was for the best. I want to be like a present. Honesty is like a gift. Wanami, thank you so much for the gift. Such a lovely hair clip. I have something I want to ask, but I think it's better in person. I'll call you again, okay? And then hot springs are okay. My horror, it's Wanami. You can come to the hot springs with me. It's really fun. Good again soon. Okay. Um, I want to get the bad end. But I think that's when. You lose all of your hearts. And I think I know how to do that, so I'm just gonna skip ahead. And that would be me. Let's see. Where was that room on the second floor? Going by a drink. Okay. That's one of the hearts gone. Kept my heart, so let's take it away. I'll just take a shower back in my room. It won't cause trouble for anyone else. This room too, I can relax until dinner. No point in loitering here. We can't even take a shower? Get in a quick nap. Maybe I'll get in a quick nap. Already kind of tired. Patron's already out, but the tatami is nice. I'll just take a quick nap. I pass quickly. And then I say they were great. Oh, there it goes. Really relaxing. That's wonderful. And everybody's happy about that. We ate. I'm a bit tired, so. Here they are for asking. Tip of the baths. We have dots. So disappointed, Nagata. But if doesn't want to talk about it, totally fine. To sleep. A bit exhausted. Are you okay? Yep, it's just been a long day. If you say so. I'm gonna head out to get some drink. Good night. Bye, Monami. I'm just not up for a conversation right now. It's morning. I don't think anyone else is awake yet. I won't get changed. 
left a note in the room telling Monami I would be leaving first. It's a bit too exhausted to talk to anyone right now. I'm doing my best to enjoy this hot spring trip. But... I guess this is just impossible for me. I just want to go home to my bed. I'll apologize to Monami over the phone later. For now, I just don't want to be here anymore. Bed and hot springs are not okay. That that one hurt. I was wondering, I got your message. You're okay, you said you were tired. But I could tell you were feeling comfortable. Just call me back, okay? Okay, now we have Monami, two for Erica. I think I should do Erica. Beep boop. Do reserved. Let me do that would be me. Probably should have done the other one, huh? I didn't go in. Well, I was feeling tired anyway, so I took a nap. Hey then, I'm fine, Monami. Change with the hot springs. Then we eat. Let's talk to you. It's been a while. How you doing? What do you want to talk about? This is a bit curious. Since you're the first transgender person I've ever met. Way to come out the gate swinging. That might not be true. Yeah, yeah. Hmm? Might have met other transgender people before, but you just didn't notice. Maybe. To be honest, if one of you hadn't told me, I wouldn't have known you were, Suzuki. I just call you Haru. You can call me Erika. I don't mind. Haru then. Is that like your transgender? Nah, way to go. No, they have a name and then they have a dead name. So if they introduce themselves as a name, that is their name. Point blank, end of story. No, it's a nickname from when I was a kid. Oh, so a nickname from when you were still a guy. I... I'm the right person to be handling this. I feel like I was a guy before. I've always been a girl. Just my appearance doesn't completely match who I am. Sorry, I shouldn't have phrased it that way. What's your name again? I heard I had to check in. Her name is Haru. That's what it is. Haruto, right? <sighs> my god. You probably shouldn't ask that sort of thing to transgender people. Why? Asking for a name someone isn't using now is kind of like denying who they are now. So... It's called dead naming. Oh, sorry about that. I didn't mean it that way. Could you forget it? It's okay. I actually like the name Haru. It's you in a sex. I'd like to change my little name to Haru if I can. Oh. Guess since you haven't changed your name, you can't use Haru on official documents and stuff. Yep. Guess your legal gender is still. Yep. Must be hard on you. You need to change it. It's a bit tough. We need to get gender affirmation surgery and be sterilized. What? I mean, I guess gender affirmation surgery is cool. It's if you want to change your body anyway. We need to be sterilized. Yeah. That was some countries. Change your gender without doing either. I don't exactly know 
the whole process because it, it's a complicated process. Lots of paperwork. Like the whole shebang. But from what little I do... I do know. You can change it without the surgery. It just requires lots of paperwork and money. At least here in the US. As of publishing the video. I didn't know. Yeah, there are a lot of requirements. You just have to be above 20, not married currently, and have no kids or minors. Hmm. Wait, why do you have to be unmarried and have kids? The marriage bit. Because if you change gender, it becomes same sex marriage. And that's illegal in Japan. Dang. Do the children bit. Apparently it would be confusing for them or something. The hell? I know. I don't make the law. It might get better though. Some wards allow same sex partnership now, after all. I didn't realize it was so bad. It's pretty bad. I'm sorry for asking you so many questions. I hope it didn't make you uncomfortable. I don't know what to do about this. Because <laughs> again, I'm, I'm not in the, the same scope, the same spot. I really... I don't know if I'm doing this correctly, is the thing. I hope I am, and if I'm not, I'm so sorry. But I guess this one... It's okay, I'm actually happy. Thank you for listening. Thank you for sharing with me. Okay. I think after I made you spill out all of that, I definitely owe you one. Hmm. What are the attendants earlier? Apparently, while well, their official stance is that you should enter the bath of your legal gender. This is a question they're actually asked quite often. And they decided that it was unofficially okay, as long as you didn't bother other guests. There aren't too many guests today, it's a weekday. And she said that the bath would probably be empty around midnight. So? So nobody would have a problem if you went to the women's bath. Because nobody would be there. I can't just go in. I'm down, I'll be fine. What if somebody's there? The baths are big. We'll just keep away from them. What if they look? They won't look. I and mean, if they do, who cares? Who says anything? I'll beat them up. Get you a supportive friend. Please don't beat them up. Then be fine. You were drinking earlier. It was hours ago. It's out of my system now. That's not how alcohol works. Come on, Haru. Don't you want to enter the woman's bath? You're a woman too. You have the right. Erica. Yes. I, I think we should. Okay, I'll go. But if anything happens, it'll be fine. Let's grab our towels and go. Wait, come on. Sorry, Monami. Actually, I think I'll... Oh, I made all the way here already. Let me check to make sure nobody else is inside. All the keys are in the lockers. Nobody's in the hot springs. Come with me. Okay. Don't worry, I'll change over here. I won't look or anything. Thanks. You can head first to wash. See you later then. Wow, this art style is so cute. So nice in here. Why do I feel so smooth? Why, why the towel? Why, 
I don't get it. Because in every... I'm not going to say every. In almost every anime that I have seen, when there is, like, a bath or a spring or something like that, they have the towel on their head, and I don't understand why. Like, it doesn't do anything, it just sits. You so that we can fall dramatically, but even Aka has one now. I guess they got a lot of minerals in it. That's good for your skin. A bunch of charcoals in there. What do you think? Pretty good, right? Yeah. Thanks for bringing me. I don't see what the big deal is. I don't understand why you didn't just come to the bath with Monami and me. I don't get it. What don't I get? Mm. Let's pretend for a moment you are in. This one would be the better analogy. School restroom. We both girls and both boys. Which one do you go into? Not for girls, of course. Of course. What if a student in a male uniform came into the washroom then? I guess I'd tell them they were in the wrong washroom. Of course. But what if they said they were in the right one? Probably call a teacher. This isn't just pretend, is it? Straight from experience, aren't you? People like you know exactly where you belong. People like me don't belong anywhere. We can't just enter bathrooms or change rooms or toss springs. We're going into the men's restroom like this and we're seen. I'd be told I was in the wrong washroom. But society tells me I can't use the women's restroom either. It's the same for the hot springs. So we have to watch out for ourselves. As nobody else will. Even though we just want to live like everyone else. It must have been really tough for you in high school. My school wouldn't allow boys to wear anything but the male uniform. But I didn't act like how they thought a boy should act. I called a lot of names because of that. Yeah, high school students can be vicious. I was at an all-girls school. These are pretty bad sometimes. Monami never said anything like that. Oh yeah, she's Monami. Nothing bad ever happens around her. I was a bit of a delinquent. A bit of a delinquent? We may inform wrong. Find them bullies. Smoke into the toilets. Don't smoke, kids. But awesome. You know the usual. Eh, I, I don't know how usual that is. I got over that rebellious phase now. Right, okay, it's gonna be pretty awful. Those bullying isn't as obvious as custom bruises, but it sticks with you. It's far more psychological than physical. We bully too. It wasn't that bad. I didn't fit in. Mommy was pretty much my only friend in high school. And we weren't even in the same class. My room teacher said it was my fault for not trying to be nice. So I just stopped caring. It's awful. Right? That's just how things are in high school. Who don't fit in? We'll never fit in. You better just stop caring and enjoy yourself. With people who don't mind that you're different. Yeah. Sorry for that incredibly depressing speech. Nah, no, nah. No. I'm really happy that you shared it with me. I don't know why. I feel like somebody's lifting a weight off my shoulder. Ah, then I'm glad I talked to you. You don't want me any of this. No. I could never tell her. She's done so much for me. It would just make her sad if she knew. Oh, wait, I'm sure this now. You like Monami, don't you? No. You don't have to say anything. You know that she's... You know, right? There's so many you knows. Yeah, I know. She talks about her boyfriend a lot. He sounds like a really nice guy.
I mean, I did, don't think there's any problem with that, okay? I've dated a girl before, too. Really? Yeah, back when I was in high school. I dated somebody at my part-time job. So you're bi, then? Bi? That you like both men and women? Maybe. To be honest, I don't really know. I don't care much for labels. That's cool. Here to you. Want to go to another bath? But a nice hot one. In a cypress wood. Sure. That's great. This one is the best at night when it's quiet. Yeah. Thanks for bringing me. Ah, like I said, it's not a big deal. I'm gonna grab a drink. What do you want? Oh no, it's okay, I'm fine. I'll just use for you. Wait here for a bit. Mark is an interesting person, but nice. I guess I should wait here. Get you some herb tea. Thanks. Tea's good. Alright. I'm done drinking that. Let's head back to our room. Okay. Okay, I'm tired as hell, so I'll see you in the morning. Good night. Good night. I should get some sleep too. I think I'll have good dreams tonight. It's morning. You finally decided to wake up. Hmm. Who do you think it is? Time for breakfast? Breakfast was over ages ago. It's almost time for checkout. What? I need to change. I'm down. Why don't we still with that? We still have some time. Oh. Let's jump from Monomy again. Hey. Do you have, like, the world's lowest sense of self-worth or something? Hmm? You caught jump from Monomy again? Are you kidding me? I just wanted to check out. What last trouble? She's your best friend, right? What do you think of helping her out is trouble? Of course not. Exactly, same for Monami. Wow, you're really helpless, aren't you? Want to hurry up and get dressed. I'm always waiting in the lobby. Hi, I just finished checking us out. Thanks, Monami. It's nothing. Also, I got a message from my boyfriend. He says he wants to treat us all to lunch. Nice to meet you too. Oh, that's wonderful. One of me would love to. Actually, I was gonna take Haru on a tour around town after this. Why are we pushing her out on her birthday? Sorry. Really? What? You know, Saru didn't get to go into the women's baths. It felt really bad for her, so I thought I'd take her out for a bit. And I'll go too. Nah, nah, go meet your boyfriend. It's her birthday weekend. She's got something planned for you. But Haru, will you be okay? I'll be fine. Oh, <laughs> my heart. <laughs> it feels like I'm dishing her on her birthday. And that sucks. The head of boyfriend for us. Okay then. It makes me happy to see you two getting along. Thank you for for me, Erica. Out of first then. See ya. See you later, Monami. So we're taking a tour around town? Nah, I just figured that you wouldn't want to meet up with Monami's boyfriend. But if I didn't say anything, you would have just agreed, right? Probably. It's hopeless. Anyway, I do actually want to take a look around town. Not sure where to go, though. Good morning. Miss Legata, yes? It's the attendant who told me that the baths were empty at night. Oh, thank you very much. It was nothing. If you plan to visit the town, may I suggest the hot spring on this flyer? Oh. They have lovely private baths. They can be reserved by anyone. My older sister often goes there. Older sister? Yes. She also finds it hard to go into women's baths when there are many people about. So it's your sister also? Yes. So I just wanted to say. I hope you have a wonderful time here at the hot springs. Forgive my intrusion. That was pretty cool. Yeah. I should take the lady's advice. Then check out the reserved baths. Yeah, that would be nice. Let's go then. Erica N2. The world can be kind too. That was nice. Now what? 
what's gonna happen when I don't go to the baths? No. Sorry, I just can't. I'm so male legally. I don't feel like it's okay for me to go into the female space. That's just legally right. The gender means that even if you have a guy's body, you're still really a girl, right? Yes, but... Sorry, Eric, I just can't. You're without me. I know, I'll push it. It'll take a while. So I had to bed first, okay? Pretty late. She gets to sleep. It's morning. Good morning, you're finally awake. I knew she would never wake up. Two. Eric is still asleep. I brought me behind my back. So mean of you, Monami. No, I was just saying. I'm just kidding. Good morning, you two. Good morning. I guess it's time to check out. It is. You two missed breakfast. It's okay, I'm not that hungry anyway. Me for yourself, I want breakfast. I might say that. Actually, I got an attendant to pack up one breakfast bento for each of us. I'll check out. If I'm doing that, you two should get dressed. If you're in the lobby. I will never understand that you can be so energetic in the morning. Some people can do that. It's wild. Me neither. I guess we should get changed. Yeah. Ooh, before you go. Mm. Sorry. Before. I was kind of insisted of the whole trip. I didn't mean to be. But I know it made you feel comfortable. But I think I know a little bit better now. Forgive me. Listen to me. Not everyone does. Let's get changed then. Don't want to keep on me waiting. Right, but you hurry. Finally, what took you two so long? Oh, it wasn't that long. What about those breakfasts you mentioned? Right here. I didn't breakfast yet, either. We can eat them together on the train right back. Oh, I... I'm taking a different train. Like when I came here. What? Don't tell me you're going in a different train. Why didn't seem direction right? Let's head back together. I want to head back together, too. So I have lots I want to talk about. Me, too. Let's decide it then. Yeah, let's go. Erica and one. New friend, new adventures. That's a very cute bento. Okay. And with that, I'm going to go ahead and end this episode here. So thank you very much for watching, and hopefully, I will see you later.